Andy, coming here with a personal best of 349.44 into the 50 nanometer. You, from the start, you right away took the lead and left everybody behind you. How, uh, how, how was the race in your mind? Um, well, I had a plan that if it was slow at the start, I'd go to the front and try and make the pace faster. And it made the race more honest. And that was exactly what happened. I could pretty much tell. So, just went to the front and I thought there would be a few more guys with me, but... I ended up breaking away, which I was really quite surprised about. But I was obviously very relieved when I came down the home straight in first. Was there at some point uh, uh, some a bit difficulty, or did, were you racing like in a comf comfortable pace? Um, I kept making sure that I was pushing the pace, keeping it high, and making sure that I didn't lose all my form and didn't r start running badly and I felt really good mentally as well. So I don't think there necessarily was any problems in the race. It would have been nice to have someone with me to maybe push a bit of a faster time, but I can't complain with a win. And, and for now, you, you, this year you also participated in Donetsk at the World Youth Championships. Um, how much experience do you have with international races? Uh, this is my first year where I've actually gone outside of the UK to race. So it's been a really good experience year for me because I've been the lower end of my age group, so I've been racing guys a lot faster and a lot stronger than me. But the international competition, it gives that extra experience and it's something completely different because in different countries they race differently. So it's always really good to have something to do like that where you're learning how to race properly rather than just on the national scale. It takes it up to international, plus the trips are really fun as well. So. And was a kind of eye-opener? Uh, in Donetsk it really was, because there was the whole world there, the whole, all the countries like Kenya and Ethiopia and all, all the African nations as well. And it shows how, how different all the children or boys of my age are. You get people who are really well developed and then people like me who aren't so well developed. And uh, yeah, it really opens up your eyes as to how big the differences can be and how different they can race. And in the future, which, which di distance will you be running? Um, I'd like to say 1500 because I really enjoy that, but I've got a feeling that I might, have, might move up maybe to 5000 meters or I don't know. Hopefully I can stay at 1500 though, that's my favorite at the moment. First today, it, it was a good feeling about your race, right? Yes, yeah, I'm very pleased, very pleased. I wasn't expecting to, to come out here and win it seeing some of the other guys' times, so it's very relieving and very pleasing as well.